Now, tonight, on the heels of California declaring a state of emergency over the spread of bird flu, new questions now and concerns over keeping not only people safe, but wildlife and endangered species as well. ABC 7 News reporter Tara Campbell spoke with one of Oakland Zoo's top veterinarians about how it is staving off the virus and protecting one of the state's most vulnerable birds. Bird flu spreading rapidly across California's dairy farms, infecting herds and causing illness across the nation. And now concern is spreading across the nation's zoos. We test all our own birds regularly if they're sick. Um, and so far, since the beginning of HPAI a few years ago, we haven't had a single bird here. The Oakland Zoo putting into action its preparedness plan running on a scale of one through four. When we hit the higher levels, like with more recent cases in the inner Bay Area uh, picking up over the last couple months, uh, we've moved from what we call level two to level three. So a little more biosecurity. Um, we do foot baths, feeding strategies to minimize exposure to wild birds. They're also working closely with others in the Association of Zoos and Aquariums. It's Lindsay Wildlife Museum. It's the USDA um, really working international bird rescue, all talking to each other, sharing information on what we're seeing as this outbreak progresses and, and really ebbs and flows. And top of mind are these beloved birds, the California condors. The USDA did approve a vaccine for HPAI for California condors as a critically endangered species. Um, so we, of course, our five condors that we have here at the zoo are vaccinated for HPAI. And with that emergency approval, they're taking the vaccine beyond zoo borders. We're supporting the Yurok site, uh, Ventana, Big Sur site, um, and also the Pinnacle site. We've been going out in the field and vaccinating birds in the field, working with the biologists in those areas as well. And taking the moment to make clear the zoo is still very much a safe place for people. We have a full service 17,000 square foot veterinary hospital here on campus. So any sick animal is treated right away. So I think I can say with confidence there's no risk to the public from birds here on the campus at Oakland Zoo. Tara Campbell, ABC 7 News.